pharmaceutical companies are inching closer to the finish line. There are over 170 vaccine candidates around the world. Eight are in the final stage of human trials. Proving them to be effective, safe and achieve regulatory approval isn't the only challenge. We have to go from there to actually having billions of doses of vaccine uh, that can be delivered to people around the world. We're investing in the process of manufacturing before we even know whether a given vaccine will reach licensure and could be used. Governments around the world have committed billions of dollars to vaccine makers, buying up hundreds of millions of vaccine doses, which may not even work. Pfizer, in partnership with BioNTech, plans to make 100 million doses of its vaccine candidate by the end of the year, and over a billion next. Well, it is absolutely not normal. It's unprecedented. To try and meet that demand, Pfizer has set up separate manufacturing in the US and Europe and is drawing on all its resources. This really is a collaborative effort. It has to be. Um, you know, in this case, uh, the, the race, right? The people talk about the competition, right? Um, the competition is, is not each other, right? It really is working against the virus. Making the vaccine isn't the end of the challenge. Next up, getting it to those that need it all over the world. Companies like UPS plan to be ready to pick up, store and deliver a successful vaccine. We don't know who's going to be first. We know uh, that Pfizer, Moderna, AstraZeneca with Oxford University. We know that CanSino in China uh, is, is doing well. We know that Novavax is moving fast. Different types of vaccine need different transport and storage conditions. One of the biggest challenges is temperature. Keeping the vaccine safe and secure is critical and UPS plans to have 24-7 tracking for every single vial. We are taking very seriously the fact that our clients are counting us on us to move every single vial and not lose a single one. And they're not alone. Vaccine developers, suppliers, manufacturers and logistics firms are all taking unprecedented action, not just to make, but to deliver a vaccine for COVID-19. Anna Stewart, CNN, London.